All right, boys, welcome to the channel, Mac Dr. Bill. Today we're working on Kimball's new wheel. The Milgen type stop wheels, they are stamped. I can't for say, say they Milgen, but they Milgen style. However, I crossed them off with a brush pad. Got them ready. This is my method of painting. Maybe some of you are familiar with it. Maybe some of you are not. Simply use the memo cords. Place them around the rim area. As many you need until you cover the tire as much as possible. You're not going to get painted. Once cough down, wipe it down. Paint the choice of your rim. I already done got the other three wheels done to kill time of to kill time of camera. However, I'm gonna get this one done. One is done. Let it dry. I show you guys all four of them done with the hook caps on. If we have a chance, throw them on the hatch. If not, we save them till next time. We got a little bit flurry, so that one time I hurry up. My day off, I would just bore. So I figured why not. You guys see the color transform transformation, sort of. You know, everything counts. Your self motivation. A little bit of spray can goes a long way. So if you gotta paint them 10, 4 times, whatever it takes, get them done. So with that being said, I'm gonna spray them up real quick. All right, boys, this is what the wheels look like. They all finish. The fourth one is the last one. It's still a little humid. I'm gonna let it dry. As you guys see it's snowing right now. So I'm the way to water. Just put them in on the hatch. Just leave it for another day. And we'll put them on another day. It's not snowing. I didn't think it was gonna snow today. So my plan was, I'm off. It's nice, get them painted, install them. A lot of rap, but having a hard time. I said it the last one, I had to like kind of dry it with a blow dryer a little bit, heat gun to help it dry up faster because this is not painting temperature at all. But you shouldn't let it stop you as long as it's flat black or flat white colors. Now, anytime you got any gloss in it, it's gonna take over 25 minutes, which in this weather is basically two three hours just to touch it and it's gonna be damp so for flat colors yes which i went with a frost white flat white kind of bring the milgan style out of them they sort of look like type part wheels from a dc5 but they not these are going on kimball the single cam hatch they all got the uh, honda emblem new one just gotta put that one on because i was getting painted but um yeah basically these are the new tires for kimball they are 205 60 16 the tires wheels are 16 inch they are milgan style and for a minute i was looking something different aside the si looks and the lf's webs and even the HF wheels. Now that I'm tired of it, but I want to some, go for something different. So that was the look I'm going for. Let them dry up. These are dry to the touch. The last one, still not so much. Even though you guys see me dry with the heat gun. I'm going to put the center cap. Let it dry a couple more minutes. And decide what we do. If it's not any hotter, we we'll stop it for another day. Put them on the hatch. Whatever we have to do. If it happened to slow down snow-wise a little bit, we might throw them quick. Because it's not so much for luxury. On Kimball, the HF wheels, when I traded the SI tires, the own wheels on the HF are bad. And I end up driving that shit to the work the other day like that, and I didn't get no grip. So this tire, however, 
they seem to see uh, the BO season they got good track so besides changing the look we're gonna give a purpose on the car in case they do need the hatch they do get tires that would actually grab on so I'm gonna let it dry and come back let's get it This is the curtain conditions, you guys see. Seems to keep snowing a little bit. It's like Christmas all over. But thankful we didn't get snow earlier, so now. Like it was mid Christmas and it didn't snow, so. We're so all done. The old painted, the old got the center cap. And just letting them dry here for extra time. You know what I mean? Just because paint dries up sometimes doesn't mean that the paint is cured. You gotta give it time to cure a little bit. Not sure, no rush in throwing. If I see the wear doesn't get any better, we save them for next time. No harm done. So I'm giving it enough fuel, see what's up. And uh, But yeah, overall, it's something we could do at home to your tires. Whether you're bored, you wanna switch it up a little bit, or even color match your car. This is something we could do at home. Soft motivate, keep motivated. So we'll come back. All right, boys, so it's a few hours after to show you the different in climax and some weather. This is what I meant. I couldn't really do it earlier. Overall, rims look pretty nice. Transform the wheels. If we can look sick now. Just gotta wait to lose the pass up, which you guys won't wait that much. So I'll pick this up probably over tomorrow, as soon as we get a chance after work or something. Um, get the right lug nuts and throw the wheels on. Why can't you do more than nature, boys? Check it out, boys. Day after. No one's gone, rain stopped. Got log knocks for the rims. So without further ado, let's throw them on. Let's get it. This is the log knot we need for this. Two millimeter by 1.50. Sort of like locking knot. Comes with your uh, special tool. Put them on, install them, whatever. Got the whole kit. So I don't deal with like old shit, you know, it's rusted and stripped out. Simply gonna put the hatch back here. Throw them in. The hatch is dirty as shit. One them stole them. Gonna pressure watch her real quick and uh, see what today brings. So let's get it. Check it out. 
different look for Kimball. The contrary of the Wolverine, sort of want a sleeper, kind of a choke car slash street car. So cars that want to drive everywhere, where I don't have to worry. This is gonna call too much attention. Just the usual. Car looks dope. Needs a lot lowering. I'm not worried about lower right now. It's winter mode. That shit ate my lip the other day on the RXX, so nonsense on dropping cars. But transforming the car, it does. Wanna get a spoon dog bill style rear wing for the back. Uh, baby, a tight bar lip for the front. That's about it. And um, some windshield visors. That's as much as I want to go with this at. Maybe some tint. And um, get the quarter panel so I could do the little bit of quarter panels on. Send a truck, whatever little bit better works on it. And get her painted. Gonna be a stock clean build. So, trying to keep it as much as we am I can. Alright, so, put this tire back and we'll come back.
right, boy. Things is looking mighty sexy. I like the way they feel. I thought it was gonna be a little too heavy, but the hatchet moved pretty decent. So we're just taking it for a quick ride. About to go to the crib, cut out the date, just wrap it up. But um, yeah, look the new wheel start, boys. So with something to prove, whether it's motivation wise. Let's get back to the crib. Alright boys, we're gonna wrap it up. Kimball runs amazing. I love the wheels. I love how they ride. They definitely stay on. I don't want that fast and furious look on it. I don't want the slicks on it. This is the look that I was looking for. Something that we could hook up a little bit more and have a normal clean looking build. So I hope this video was motivational in any shape or form. Something as simple as just trading wheels, painting them, whatever it takes to carry on with your motivation and your current build. So with that being said, I want to thank every single one of you for subscribing, liking and commenting. Till next time. Peace.